<laughs> he was so far off court, he had no idea whether Warwick shot was in or out. He was actually walking to shake hands. 14, 15. He'd heard no call. Had to ask the umpire what that was it. Still two well, major please, thank you. to Andy Roddick. Roddick uh, 4 6, uh, 7 6, 4 6, 6 4, 21 19. It's a win for the ages. Surely one of the greatest singles matches ever played. John McEnroe, who will speak with Eunice Alanui and Andy Roddick of the United States of America. And then you crowd say it all, that is one of certainly the most extraordinary matches I've ever, ever, ever had the privilege of calling. Andy, I'm going to start with you. Why don't you say a quick word about your opponent tonight? Oh, man. He, he looks like he's ready to go another set. I, she's, <laughs> no, but uh, Eunice is a class act. And uh, he, he showed the other day by beating Leighton that he's one of the top players in the world. And uh, I'm extremely humbled by this victory. Eunice, you're an extraordinarily fit man at the age of 31, a father of two. How in the world do you do this, to dig as deep as you've dug the last couple days? Uh, I've been working out a lot these last few years. <laughs> you sure have. Yeah. So, um, my legs were feeling a little bit heavy at the end. and. Uh... What point did you get tired of, like 17 all in the fifth? And uh, Andy kept serving uh, really hard. I thought I had a chance when I broke him when he was serving uh, for this match earlier. But he just kept a very high level and uh, I was waiting uh, for an opportunity, but uh, he just kept it all the way and uh, congratulate him. Yeah, well, for sure. And one last question before I let you go. You came from the country of Morocco. Now, I don't, I'm not familiar with the tennis history there. How did you get to your start in tennis and be the player you are today? Well, it was uh, really, I was fortunate that I could have some parents uh, for, uh, they, can, they could afford to support me. And uh, basically, I'm the first uh, 
player who make a living out of tennis in my country, and I'm sure. Let's hope you're not the last. No, yeah. Hisham Arazi is there. I say hi to him. I thank him for the support and the, all the crowd is just terrific. Um, even if I lost, I'm happy. Yunus Elanawi. Andy Roddick, I mean, you tell us now for a second how you're feeling. You came from two sets to love down and a break for the first time in your career two days ago. This extraordinary match here. You've only got two more to go. <laughs> yeah, why don't, why don't we just start them now? <laughs> no, uh, I'm not even thinking about the next match. I'm going to take... I'm hoping today's a, like seems like a long day tomorrow that I have off. <laughs> would, you, would you prefer to play Saturday? <laughs> Well, it doesn't matter. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to come out and play Friday and give it my best. It's your first Grand... Yeah. It's your first ever Grand Slam semifinal. Andy, you've got tons of support down here. You must have felt like the crowd helped you through this one tonight. It was really special playing that fifth set. I mean, Eunice and I, I'm, I'm sure we knew that it was something special, but the crowd was awesome. Um, you played a big part in keeping us on our feet up there. We'd love more of the same, Andy Roddick. Let's hear it for Andy Roddick. Congratulations.